This is question number 38 from chapter 6 of Walker's Physics, 4th edition. And chapter 6 is on applications of Newton's laws. The question asks us to predict and explain, referring to the hanging planter in example 6-5, which of the three graphs, A, B, or C, in figure 626, shows the accurate plot of tensions T1 and T2 as a function of the angle. Oh, who knows? So let's, let's see. I've got a triangle here, so I'm going to break the triangle up into components because that's all I know to do. Some of it's going to be a horizontal, and some of it's going to be a vertical. So what cancels or balances with what? Because that pot is not moving. So it must be in equilibrium, and if it's in equilibrium, everything balances. So this is going to balance with this, and this is going to balance with this. Does that make sense? All right, so this is going to be T2 times the sine of theta, and this is T2 times the cosine of theta. So these two cancel each other out. These two equal each other. All right, so times the sine of theta. What is the sine of 90? Because I can imagine you've got a 0 and a 90 here, so the sine of 90, I bet it's 1. Yep. All right, so as, as this guy, as this angle ra raises, going from theta up to 90, where theta is 90, what's going to happen? Okay. The T2 is always going to be supporting the weight of the pot. And T2 cosine of theta is always going to be uh, countering, I guess, the tension on the wall. So if you're at 90, if you go all the way at 90, do you see that these two things are going to be equal to each other? All right, so what's going to happen? At 90, T2 needs to be supporting all of the weight. So this one doesn't work, okay? It's not supporting all the weight. Here, T2, Mg, ah, like this one. Do you see? At T2 is supporting all the weight here. What's happening when it gets to 90 here? Well, if this is supporting all the weight, this one's getting canceled down to zero, and it does go down to zero, okay? I would pick B. I don't like C, because I don't even know, like they don't even give me anything. Oh, MG's on this side. I'll say to T, oh, well, it could possibly be C. So MG is T2, but T1, no. You can't have all the weight plus some of the weight here. So this is gonna go down to zero, it has to be B. Okay, I would say B, right? Now, why? The two tensions must be equal, okay? The two tensions must be equal at some angle. Oh, that's possible. What's two say? T2 is greater than T1 at all angles and is equal to mg at 90. Oh, I like that. Okay, at 90, it's equal to the mg. Okay, as soon as this is at 90, this is with this and this goes with this. This vertical is when the theta is at 90. And this will equal that. All right. So I would say that it's two. Thank you.